Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. These are our hottest cryptocurrency news for today. Do not switch, we start right now. Bitcoin breaks key resistance as bulls try to reach key level. Bitcoin experienced a strong rally that allowed it to break the 11.600,000 resistance level. Earlier, BTC experienced a sudden burst of buying pressure, which resulted in its pricing by more than $11,600, which has long been a strong resistance level. If he breaks out of this level and holds above it for an extended period, he may see further influx by buying pressure that will allow him to break through $12,000. One analyst now notes that 11900 is a key level that he is now watching, as his reaction here could set the tone for the coming days and weeks. Bitcoin mixer punished by fine sand with 60,000 million fine. Helix was fined $60 million for acting as an unregistered MSB. According to an official press release, FinSat has filed a $60 million civil fine against Larry Dan Hammond, the man in charge of several Bitcoin privacy focused services. Larry Dean Hammond has the inspiration behind Dropbeat for the Lightning Network wallet and Bitcoin anonymization service Coin Ninja and Helix. Bitcoin mixers Helix and Coin Ninja operates as unregistered money transfer companies, according to FinCEN. Because of this, Herman acted in a way that defy US laws, evaded tax, and skipped certain requirements that would be mandatory if its platforms were licensed. Online data shows mass accumulation among Ethereum investors. Ethereum stock skyrocketed ahead of 2.0 launch. Sentiment blockchain data indicates that there is a spirit of hoarding among Ethereum holders and investors. The blockchain analyst firm recently reported that the amount of EDH held on exchanges has declined in the past two months, suggesting that investors have long-term confidence in EDH. The top 10 EDH exchanges addresses continue to transfer funds to non-exchange wallets and move assets and at impressive rate. The decline in the number of tokens on exchanges by 20.5% over the past two months indicates that confidence is the price from the leading Ethereum holders. Bitcoin miners' daily revenue falls to $345,000 amid rising wrapped Bitcoins and holding frenzy. The drop in transaction activity on the Bitcoin network has resulted in miners earning only 30 BTC per day. It is now well known that Bitcoin blockchain processes significantly fewer transactions than its Ethereum counterpart. And this decline is transaction processing has also significantly reduced miners' revenues. Chain analyst company Glassnode points to numbers that are a 5 months low or 30 BTC per day. This downward trend in Bitcoin miners' income clearly reflects the lack of interest of traders and investors in conducting transactions on the BTC network. Since they dropped, the miners have nothing to process. Fire to crypto gateway, BTC direct raises nearly 13 million dollar Series A funding. BTC Direct has raised just under 13 million in Series A funding rounds led by unknown investors. As announced on Monday, BTC Direct said this is the first significant infusion of funds into the platform, which has so far been heavily funded by its founders. Founded in 2013, the company is also launching the Blocks cryptocurrency trading application in addition to its fight to crypto trading system. BTC Direct will use the new funds to expand its staff, develop new products and expand its marketing efforts, according to the announcement. Ethereum prices to rise as Bitcoin change and Nasus approach. Ethereum prices in 2020 performed well due to increased demand from DeFi applications. Since the beginning of this year, Ethereum price have risen 170% from below $140 on the New Year's Day and the current level of around $380. There is no doubt that the main driver of demand was the DeFi sector, which grew to 100% in terms of blocked Ethereum. Today, according to DeFi, Balls, there are almost 9 million ETH, or almost 8% of the total supply locked on the various DeFi protocols. This demand for yields has driven the price of ETH up this year, and it outspaced Bitcoin, which was only about 62% of the same period. Payment 
payment provider now payments announced support for Filecoin payments immediately after launch. The news of the launch of the Filecoin mainnet was evading both the crypto company and the entire crypto community as a whole. Since several major exchanges have posted their own field token for Filecoin prior to launch, Payment Gateway Now Payments has done its best to keep up with the crypto giants. The company announced that we started the necessary operations to support Filecoin on October 15, 2020 and authorized field payments on October 16, 2020. 2020. We believe Filecoin's mission is the entire cryptocurrency world has been waiting for. As OneDrive, Dropbox and Google Drive raise concern about this file storage policies, decentralized peer-to-peer -peer file storage is a necessary step towards a fully decentralized internet independent of government, said Pauline Shaget, director of marketing for Now Payments. Users not impressed by Chinese digital yuan after $1.5 million giveaway. The weekly test of the Chinese digital yuan is over. After a week of $1.5 million worth of digital yuan sent by 50,000 Schengen citizens, those who used the funds for regular, everyday purchases were not impressed. However, analysts said that the testing is a significant step towards the practical use of China's digital currency. Numerous central banks around the world are reported to be working to launch their own digital currency for central banks, while several reports of the past year have indicated that China is leading to race and the result have been largely theoretical. $46 million shorts eliminate as Bitcoin types $11.800. Bitcoin soars to $11.700,000, leaving beers in the dust. More than $58 million has been liquidated on a leading derivatives exchange in the past 24 hours, according to data provider by BT. The short side accounts for up to 84% of the losses. The lion's share of liquidation occurred on the Binance exchange, followed by problems with OKX. The Hong Kong FTX is the only exception, as in effect, the bulls have suffered the most on the platform. The cryptocurrency has now fully recovered after OKX identifiably suspended withdrawals and Bitcoin has dropped to nearly $11,200 due to an ongoing police investigation. Air3 Corda Network ready to move to DeFi with XDC digital currency. Corda Network Air3 advertises the first digital currency for this ecosystem dubbed XDC. On October 20, it was announced that the Corda Society, a UK registered corporative, has released the XDC crypto token on the public Corda, the open source version of the R3 network. The new regulatory friendly cryptocurrency will open the door, according to its creators, at Cordite to various decentralized finance applications powered by Corda's distributed ledger technology. So, guys, these are all news for today. Thank you for your attention. If you still have any questions, please ask them in our comment section below this video. Have a great day. See you tomorrow. Stay safe. Bye.